Hey there, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about uh, uh, Shopify auto currency switcher. So, this tutorial will be helpful if you are using Shopify for your online business and your business spread around mul multiple countries. Then you can continue this tutorial with me. So, in this tutorial, so I'm going to use this Shopify app auto currency switcher. A best currency converter to check out in multi currency and it has already uh, more than 4000 review and most of the bit positive review and we can try this app as uh, free because the free plan also available and the important feature is that this uh, app help you to convert currency automatically following or based on user countries or uh, location so let's start the to add this app in our online store and then we can learn how can we use this app or setup so let's continue so I, I have logged in my Shopify online store now going to click on the app button so now going to click on the uh, visit the Shopify app store then we will search this app in the uh, Shopify app store so I just trying to load this space so we are in the Shopify app store website now going to search this app and click on the search icon and we will use this app Auto currency switcher by ML beta. This one, and going to click on the add app button. okay so we have added this app in our shopify online store now we have to install and set up then we can review our website so i'm just waiting to load this full page okay so now going to click on the install app button right here okay so we have installed this app now I am going to visit my website so my current location from Bangladesh so following my location our my store should show the currency of Bangladesh Taka so I hope this will show right now Bangladesh Taka so I'm going to click uh, on the any product for example going to click on the this product and I already see uh, they show the price uh, and as Bangladesh Taka and uh, the converted this price following my location so I hope you can add this app and install in your Shopify online store so thank you for your time to continue this tutorial with me if you need any help relevant Shopify then you can contact with me